Do you think the Premier of Ontario, Mike Harris, is dyeing his hair? I couldn't care less. I never really gave it much thought. <laughs> <laughs> I have no idea. I haven't seen the news, like, forever. I, I... All right, here's a hypothetical question. Yeah. Would you care? No. No. You make the call. Here's Premier Harris a while ago, and here he is today. Mr. Harris himself is unavailable for comment, but a source close to the Premier says that when he goes to the barber, he gets his barber to cut out the gray hairs. And sometimes they think by coloring their hair, they can, you know, hide their age and <laughs> not necessarily show it, but I find gray hair great, so no, I think it's sexy. Most women find gray sexy, but men tend to not think so, but, um, <laughs> you know, it all depends on how you pull it off. Does he or doesn't he? Nobody really knows, and as we've just proven, absolutely nobody cares. Mike Harris would not be the first politician to have dyed his hair. There's another fellow named of Ronald Reagan, you may remember. He had some kind of job with the U.S. government for a number of years a little while back. Helping to kill time on what's obviously a very slow news day, I'm Justin Smallbridge for City Pulse.